Look, everyone, you can pinpoint the exact moment her heart rips in half. Look, I know the song is called Beyond the Sky, but I didn't know the title implied where her hopes and dreams went to after this scene. I've said it before and I'll say it again. Xenoblade Chronicles 1 was the developers experimenting with how much emotional trauma they can unload on one character. Because I want the roaster, don't get me wrong, but I would honestly just feel bad because the game did a good enough job job of doing that for me. And it wasn't even just a one-off or a couple of scenes near the end, like N in Xenoblade 3. Au contraire, mon ami. This was consistent, surgical, and executed with precision. It was so bad, they made Future Connected just so she could have some kind of dub. She'll 